Almost heaven, West Virginia, Blue Ridge Mountains, Shenandoah River. Life is old there, older than the trees, younger than the mountains, growing like a breeze. Country roads, take me home to the place I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama, take me home. Country road. All my memories gather round her. Miner's lady, stranger to blue water. Dark and dusty, painted on the sky. Misty taste of moonshine, teardrop in my eye. Country road. Take me home to the place I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama. Take me home, country road. I hear her voice in the morning hours. She calls me. Radio reminds me of my home far away. Driving down the road, I get a feeling that I should have been home yesterday. Yesterday, country road, take me home to the place I belong. West Virginia, bound to mama, take me home, country road. Take me home, country roads. <clears throat> All right, wow. It's a bit windy, but it's not too cold up here. We're looking out over um, Pendleton, uh, up on the other side of Snoqualmie Pass right now. We're here uh, right outside of Yakima, Washington. Uh, so I am uh, here near Pendleton, Oregon, and this is maybe a good place to talk about why I love Seattle so much. Um, mostly because, I mean, the number one reason that I, I love, the thing I love about Seattle that feels unique to me is the diversity. Economic diversity, racial diversity, religious diversity, and anything you can imagine uh, wanting to find, uh, you can find it in Seattle. <laughs> I will always want to be connected to Seattle for that reason because the different ideas, different people that I've been exposed to at Seattle has really had an influence in my life and it will always, always be important to me. Yeah, so saying goodbye to Seattle and uh, about to head back on the road toward Boise. I think it's about time to get on the road again. All right, time to head back on the road. <laughs> Oh, boy, it's cold. That wind.